Okay, you guys, so I am at CVS, my um, local drugstore. I wanted to pick up some of my mascara, and I thought that I might as well film a little bit. Um, I watched a um, Tati video, which probably a lot of you also saw, of the Best of 2018 Drugstore Edition. Um, Oh, I like this mascara. I used to use this primarily. Oh, you can't even see it. Sorry. I use this mascara. I used to use this. I used it for a long time. Um, and then I decided I needed to learn more about mascaras. Anyway, I watched a... Oh, and I really like this brow pencil. Actually. I have been using this. I just started doing my brows recently. And I like that. Um, you can get a really subtle brow look with that pencil. Anyway, okay, so I watched the Best of 2018 Drugstore um, videos that Tati did, and I wrote some things down that I want to uh, try out. You know, I bought this on sale recently. I know a lot of people who love that mascara, and I can't, I don't find it to be very volumizing. I need to find CoverGirl. I'll show you my favorite mascara right now. Okay, so here's CoverGirl. I'm really excited because I think it was in October, CoverGirl announced that they were officially cruelty-free, and CoverGirl has my favorite mascara, so that worked really, really well for me. Although I don't see it. I don't see it. So I am going to try this color out. This had, um, this long lasting lip color was my favorite in a color called, um, Won't Move Mauve. And this is the Superstay by Maybelline. And they discontinued that color. And I thought that maybe they had discontinued the entire line, the entire formula, but it looks like they haven't, but they discontinued my favorite color for some silly reason, um, which was mo Won't Move Mauve, but now they have one called Firmly Mauve, so I'm hoping that it's similar. I'm gonna go ahead and try it. Um, yeah. This is a nice color. I think I'm gonna spring for my nail polish. I like Elsie. Elsie's okay. OPI seems to last a little bit better, but this is nine dollars. Yeah, that's really pretty. So this jewelry is on clearance. I'm about to go a little bonkers. This ring right here is three dollars, and I kind of like it. It's three dollars. So let's see. I'll show you guys everything I end up buying, but I'm gonna take a moment and. Look at the pretty things. Look at these cute accessories. Oh, even at the drugstore. So fancy. Oh, these are kind of pretty. Hmm. I couldn't find my mascaras because they've changed the packaging. This really throws me off when they do it. I think that this is it because I was using the CoverGirl Fibers Mascara. Uh, but it looks a little bit different, but yeah. Uh, if this is the same one, and I'm going to gamble that it is, um, it is a really good mascara. I've really been liking it. Uh, so they have a whole bunch of variations on it. What's the difference here? Um, this one's not fibers. This green one isn't fibers. Big curl. Well, I want it all. I want the big curl, and I want the super sizer fibers. <laughs> anyway, um, I think that this is the one that I want. Um, but as I was saying, I'm going to look for uh, some of the products that Tati recommends. So this was in Tati's Best of Lip and Eye video. 
And this is the Makeup Academy lip gloss in the color Bear. There it is. Um, so she really, really liked this and I am feeling like treating myself. So I am gonna spring for this and test it out and see if I like it just as much as her. I actually have never tried anything by this brand, Makeup Academy, M-U-A, Mua, Mua, like a kiss. Okay, so I'm gonna give this a try. Okay, I'm about to check out now. Okay, you guys, so um, not only did I just get back from CVS, but I am also for the first time filming on my new camera. My husband and I, we wanted a family camera, and also I was going to use it for this type of stuff too, and we finally got one for Christmas. So I hope I'm using it right, and um, yeah, I'm super excited. So um, give me any feedback if anything looks funny also, please. Um, so I wanted to play a little bit with the stuff I got at CVS. So 40 Four dollars later, I got this um, color stay lips lipstick, a new nail polish, a Tati approved uh, lip gloss, and I got um, my. I, I think this is the same mascara that I've been using. They just uh, changed the look, which, like I said, really throws me off. So I really hope it's the same one. Um, and then I got this piece of costume jewelry for three dollars so i am going to play with some of this stuff and let you guys know what i think first impressions this is the nail polish color let's see okay maybe if i do this oh my gosh look at that you guys Ha! Ah, that's so much better than my phone okay so that's the color of the nail polish it's essie and it is hear me aurora is the color and then i got this little piece of costume jewelry oh my gosh wow um sorry i'm so impressed by my camera uh little piece of costume jewelry for three bucks on clearance and i have no idea what it's made of but i was actually really impressed that it uh it's made in usa it's this jewelry company called i am that is always at my cvs which was is one of the drugstores in my area um and then this is the superstay 24 hour color um by maybelline and i was really bummed because this is the color i guess i have to do this now um this is the color that I am just in love with. It is the color I am wearing today. I used to wear it every single day and they discontinued this color. Um, and I bought two on a discontinued site um, that I found for like 15 bucks each. They're usually 12. But um, so that one's called Won't Move Mauve and this one is called Firmly Mauve. And I am gonna see, I went ahead and gave it a try they they don't look the same at all <laughs> um so different so let's see if i uh like this okay okay so this is it and um it's definitely a much bolder color than the color that i just had on um right before I tried this out and I think that I could easily get used to it. I think I really like it. It is different and it's not, it doesn't feel so much like an everyday color. I will uh, say that I do like the formula of the, um, the 24 uh, color by um, Maybelline. I've been using since I thought that, since this one is pretty much, this is the one that I have loved for years, this one's pretty much gone. I have kind of switched over to um, Rimmel Provocalypse, which is also a really good um, brand. I can do a lip color video at one point, but um, I love lip colors. I don't wear a lot of makeup, but I love lip colors. Uh, so I do like this formula. Um, uh, this uh, Maybelline one. So after this dries, it has on the other side of this, it has a little um, like a chapstick kind of thing and you just put it on top so that it doesn't feel um, too uh, drying on your lips. Okay, so um, what else? I Oh, I wanted to try this lip color, this lip gloss. 
Also, uh, this is the one that was Tati approved. So I'll just go ahead and do this whole swatching thing. So that's what the applicator looks like. This is MUA MUA, which um, that is not focusing. Okay, I will get better at using this camera. Um, MUA, which is Makeup Academy. Oh, Makeup Academy, MUA. I get it. Okay, so Tati said she loves this stuff. This is in the color Bare. It's their luminizing lip gloss, and um, this is what it looks like. Swatched? Oh, that's pretty. That's pretty. Let's see if I can... I don't want to mix the color. I just put this on. Oh, it's so... Oh, yeah, that's pretty. I like it. Tati highly recommended it, and we all love Tati, I assume. I don't know. Who doesn't love Tati? That's okay if you don't love Tati. We don't all love the same things. Um, so then I got this mascara. I'll do a mascara video separately. Um, I think it's the rebrand. They redesigned the packaging. This is the one. It's all worn off. Um, it's the CoverGirl Fibers Mascara, and I love the way it works. I'm wearing it right now. Um, yeah, so anyway, thanks for joining me. Thanks for your patience while I play with my new camera. Oh, this is so exciting. I'm looking at the screen. It looks so much better than my phone. Okay, um, have a great day, and I will see you guys later. Bye.